Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Erica with Tiny Acorn. Today I am in Midtown, Reno, Nevada, and I'm about to check out a really cool vintage store down here called Junkies, and um, I think it's a thrift vintage, I'm not sure. But I um, wanted to take you guys along with me. This is kind of part of our little baby moon road trip, huh babe? Oh yeah. <laughs> I have the best husband, by the way. He's been so patient as I've been filming thrift videos in almost every town we've visited. And you guys have to check out all the rest of those videos. Um, I have a playlist for it. So anyways, make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you like it. And don't forget to subscribe. Before we hop into this thrift video, just wanted to pop in here and let you know how this video is possible. And that is with our partner, Dossier Fragrances. So if you guys aren't familiar with Dossier, let me just tell you, they're amazing. When I found Dossier, I was so excited because they actually reproduce all of those really like high-end designer fragrances, but they do it at a fraction of the cost. I love those little like tests where you can like find your fragrance or your style or whatever. And they have a really cool one on their website, which really helps to kind of like figure out what sort of scents that you would be into, which is so great because for me, I just used to spend so much time just like smelling all of these fragrances in the store. And by the time like you get to like the 10th one, you know, all of them smell the same, but this is really cool because they can kind of customize it for the scents that you know that you already like. And you just answer a few questions and then they make suggestions for you. So I picked out two that popped up when I took the quiz. And the first one was this Oriental Woody based off of Tom Ford's Black Orchid. And I found that I like really, really like these like woody scents and these kind of like musky smells. So they totally hit the nail on the head when they suggested this for me to buy. I know that you might be scared to like buy something online because you haven't smelled it, but they send this little tester to you so you can try it out before you open it. Then if you don't like it, you can always send it back and they have free returns. So that's just like a no brainer to me. Free returns, you get to test it out. There's no risk there. So I tested this out. I'm definitely gonna be keeping it. I love the scent. And also it's really great is you have this little guy that you can just toss into your purse and keep and just use whenever you need it. I also got the Floriental Cedarwood. It is inspired by Muggler's Alien. It's one of my favorite. I wear it all the time. So if you guys want to try some of these amazing fragrances for yourself, please use my discount code TINYACORN10 to get 10% off of your purchase. Okay, let's go ahead and jump into the video. I'm literally in heaven right now. Like, there's so many beautiful vintage pieces, and the prices are incredible, you guys. Incredible. It's like $20, $15, $12 for a beautiful vintage dress. You have to come here. Oh my gosh, I'm in love with this dress. And this 70s little number. Oh, so cute.
What'd you find, babe? Princess Leia suit. Guaranteed design. <laughs> Ooh, Princess Leia. This is, a, this is, is that your like fantasy? A show tune. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that. Look at those bedazzles. This is like a country singer's garb. Whoa, look at that jumpsuit. I know. I just found this Eileen, Eileen Fisher dress that's so cute. Awesome is that they have these little signs up to encourage you. It's so cool. Couldn't agree more. These are pants. And this orange skirt. And this red skirt. Okay, here's my loot. I'm gonna try on as much as will fit. This dressing room though, oh my gosh, it's so extra. This whole store is extra. And there's my loving companions. They're so cute. I really like this skirt. I think it might be one of my favorite things that I found. This is that like lime green thing going on right now. Yeah. And gingham. My favorite, two of my favorite things. Nice. Here's the Eileen Fisher dress. It would look so cute when you're not pregnant, though. <laughs> I feel like a Teletubby right now. You are. <laughs> I am. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Check out the back. <laughs> it rolls it up. That's insane. I'm so sad underneath this scarf. I was looking forward to trying this dress on, and just like everything looks so funny with the, with the belly. Yeah. Right? It's just like doesn't work. It's very bright. <laughs> yeah, you look like a Raggedy Ann. I like that. That's cute. Yeah. Margo likes it. You yeah, like So just picture it with the belt on. <laughs> it looks a little big, so. Yeah, it's a little fluffy. A little big, but, but it's okay. It's cute though. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect. So this is a really cute dress, but it doesn't close. Mm. But how cute is that? So you need something underneath I love it? Patchwork. Yeah, I would have to wear a slip underneath it. Or just you know. I could also put little closures on it. If you want. Okay. Cute, yeah. <laughs> I think it might be a costume though. Huh. But I don't know. I don't know if I could pull it off in yeah. regular life. Okay, this is the last one. That's super cute. I like it, huh? I think I'm gonna get it. Cool. All right, so this did not fit me, but it's so cute. I think I might get it anyways <laughs> and just save it for like the holiday season. Um, the yellow one didn't fit, but I also really like it. 
and I might just get it and save it for after pregnancy. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys what I'm getting. I'm gonna get this dress, this little guy, the bandana skirt, this gingham skirt, this little dress with the rickrack. I'm getting this quilted dress. This yellow dress because I cannot pass up this fabric. This little white blouse. Okay, I last minute decided to get this guy as well. I just found all of these amazing patches too with women's names on them that I'm going to put all over a coat. Wow, so that was a pretty successful <laughs> trip to the vintage store. Um, so they had vintage antiques and they also had modern clothes that, uh, like I saw Free People, they had Eileen Fisher, um, other brands like that, that you could buy. So it kind of reminded me of like a Crossroads slash Buffalo Exchange type of thrift store slash vintage store. So they also had costumes and stuff like that. It was a pretty epic store. Um, I was really impressed with the selection and the prices and everything and I probably could have spent another like hour or two in there. Um, so <laughs> yes, uh, very excited about all the things that I got and excited about my little patch project that I'm going to do and put all those patches on a, on a cool coat or something. That's something that I've been wanting to do for a really long time. So I will be spending a lot of time sewing that <laughs> in the coming months. Anyways, um, please make sure to go follow me over on Instagram at tiny underscore acorn. Post a lot of IGTV content and outfit content and other stuff like that on there. I'd love to see you there. And make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you like it. And don't forget to subscribe. Huh, Margo? She says subscribe. <laughs> also, go check out some of my other videos from this epic baby moon road trip that we've taken. I've gotten some really awesome scores while thrifting on this trip. And don't forget, you're beautiful just the way you are. Bye!